Hey guys, I thought I'd make a video on how to um, make your own sound commands or sound alerts. Uh, people have asked me how I've done them for my stream, and it's actually really simple. I just, um, I obviously watched other videos, <clears throat> but people want to see like a video made for me just to see how it's done. So, and I pretty much will try and explain it as simple as possible. Uh, sorry, you're going to see all my stuff because it's display capture. So you're going to uh, minimize that. You're going to see my tabs. Uh, this is the website you want to go to. This is the bot that I use for my sound commands. I believe there's other ones like Firebot, things like that. I use Streamlabs Chatbot. It is the desktop chatbot from uh, Streamlabs. Um, it's the one that's all the way at the bottom here. It's not this one. This one just takes you to this page. You want to scroll down to you hit uh, this one. And, or you could just type the, the URL that's up here. So Streamlabs desktop app. Download it. I already have it downloaded. It's right here. So when you download it, uh, run it, install it, and all that. And then when you get to this screen, you're pretty much just gonna set it up, set it up as a bot in your in your stream. And you can see it's right here. So how you would do that is forward slash uh, mod chatbot. And then from here, you're just going to have a list of everything you could pretty much do within this program. Uh, it's pretty cool. I don't use any of the other stuff, to be honest with you. But they do have like other things like mini games, polls, betting, etc. But we're just going to strictly stick to the sound files. And I have a lot. I have three pages worth of sound commands. So the the easiest way that I do it for me is like I'll go to YouTube and search up what I want and I'll Google YouTube to MP3, copy and paste the URL into the website and then download it to my PC and then I'll throw it in my Sony Vegas or whatever program you could use that's free. You all you need to do is convert it to MP3, or if you can just find that sound bite that you want, like on a soundboard, then you could just do that. So once you download it, you're gonna um you're gonna want to come to the plus sign, hit add, votes. If you want cooldowns and stuff like that, then obviously I would add the cooldown. I don't use cooldowns for any of my stuff. So and then you could adjust the volume how you want. Uh, but just for an example, we'll just do Aquaman, something that's at the top. Type out what the command you want it to be named for your sound command. Go to pick, and then you're gonna go. I keep everything in my sound commands. So, oops, Aquaman, you would add it. I'm not gonna add this one because I already have it, but you would add it there, and then you could preview it. Um, you're not gonna hear. You're not gonna hear because I have my desktop audio muted in OBS. But you preview just to see what it sounds like, and then you can raise the volume how you want. And then just make sure you you check this generate a command, and you can set the cooldown to what you want. User cooldown. Make sure you hit submit, and then you will go back, and then it'll be there in your files your sound files and then you could just make a command like on your whatever other bot that you have like a timer or something like that or just a command for your sounds and then you could do it that way um if you have any questions you can let me know if i need to go over something else you could let me know um hopefully this video helped you out into how i upload my sound commands to this to this bot but yeah, if you want to catch the live streams, just...
go to twitch.tv slash call me 666 and you can catch me live.